Well, good morning to you. Jesus is Lord of the Word Works today, Saturday. It's a big day for me. This is the day that my family gets together to have Thanksgiving dinner. Man, I can smell the turkey cooking over there. We're going to have giblet gravy, rice, beans, uh, chocolate chiffon pies, lemon icebox pies. You know, just you have to be careful not to commit the sin of gluttony today. Going to enjoy the blessings of my family on this Thanksgiving day. And I'm enjoying the fact that God's protecting me in everything that I do. I told you yesterday how we've been delivered. We are in the process of being delivered, and we shall be delivered. I'm starting a, a new series tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock at Life of Faith Church on the ministry of angels. You've got at least 10,000 angels that are subject to you. And they're there to keep you from harm. The, the Bible says, Psalm 91, that the angels have been given charge over you. Now, you just stop and think. <laughs> you know, I think back when I was a kid, some of the dumb things I did, me and Jimmy Woodard and Johnny Nylon and some of those other people, we used to do some crazy stuff. And I'm still here today. That was because God gave each one of us a guardian angel that watched over us and protected us. And on several occasions, I've seen the ministry of angels in my behalf. And I believe they'll always be there. I don't have to see them. You say, well, I've never seen an angel. You don't have to. The Bible says they're there. There's, tri there's a trillion of them. They're there. They're to protect you. And it says over in Hebrews chapter 2, they're already sent forth and they're ministering spirits. Now watch this, to minister for them that are heirs of salvation. Well, I'm an heir of salvation. You are an heir of salvation. And, and listen, I, I'm so blessed today to tell you that all of my family, my four children are, are, are sons and daughters of the Most High God. They're, they're, they're called of God to minister the Word of God. I'm so thrilled for that. My, some of my grandchildren, of which I have 11, are already in the ministry full-time or either in school or preparing themselves for it because that's what they are called to do. I'm a blessed man. The angels have protected me all of my life. Now, I'm going to do something today, and I believe you won't tell Pat about it. Behind me here is a bunch of goodies. And, and I'm going to take this little Reese cup. You know, we buy these things for holiday seasons and when the children are going to come over. Now, watch this. I can't eat it like this. I mean, it's going to be good, but I can't eat it like this. I have to prepare it. So I have to get it down, unwrap it, get the wrapper off of it. Prepare yourself for what God's blessings are and that they're going to overtake you. Now, watch this. i got to get it completely ready. I'm prepared now to enjoy that which I've already purchased. Well, I believe that you're enjoying that which Jesus has already purchased for you. And I believe that because God's purchased it for you, you got sense enough to enjoy the blessings thereof. And particularly when it comes to the ministry of angels. God's already sent them out there. They're here for us. They're here to protect us. They're for your good. But the Bible says, oh, taste and see that the Lord is good. Probably shouldn't have done that this morning, but I want you to get the point. God has you on his mind, and it's for good things. Enjoy the blessings of God. Prepare to receive them. Enjoy them. Have a great day. And until I'm with you tomorrow, saints, remember, all day long, Jesus is Lord. Thank God the word works.